Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, and hi if you're new here, I'm Melissa and I make fashion and lifestyle and beauty content here on this channel, so let's just jump right into this haul. Obviously from the title you know that I went to Shein, well I ordered from Shein, and we're going to start with the dresses first. This first dress is a super cute mini dress with a ruffle sleeve, it's a v-neck, there's some cinching at the waist, it's not elastic or anything, it's just stitched in and it goes just above my knee. This is a cute, super, super cute staple piece for the summer. I've discussed it before. Everybody knows I feel like you need a nice, cute baby doll dress. It could be a baby doll or a maxi or even a midi length. Right now, the dress that I'm wearing is a midi length dress from Target. So it's good to have just varying lengths depending on the weather. The material isn't super stretchy. It's like a tough cotton material, but it seems super sturdy, surprisingly. I feel like this would hold up in the wash throughout the entire summer season. I know Shein is not really known for their quality, more so the quantity of clothes that you can get. So this is definitely a great piece and I would recommend getting it. If I see it in other colors, I'll for sure get it. It reminds me of that one that I get from Boohoo with the ruffle sleeve. This is a different fabric and I feel like this fabric would resist fading a little bit better than the Boohoo piece, but I really love this one. This next dress is a little bit similar. It's another mini dress with ruffle sleeves. It doesn't have a v-neck though, it has a high neck and both of them have a little button closure in the back so it's easier to put on. And this one is tiered and a little bit longer than the other one. You can probably see the tiering right here. This one again is the same fabric, super sturdy. I love the blush color. I definitely, I would recommend this one. I feel like this is a good staple piece to have at a really good price point. I got mine in a 2XL and I will write down all the sizes and all the pieces that I got down below in the description box and link it all for you. But yeah, this one fits super well. It was super comfy and I can't wait to get more use out of this one. All right, now we're gonna jump right into the bathing suits. This one is a tankini with molded cups. They're padded and it's not super long and I like that it's flowy. This one, I feel like it made my chest look a little bit weird, but I kind of like that it held up the girls a little bit and it kind of made it look like I have boobs. I mean, I thought they made my boobs look smaller. I don't know, it was a weird thing. I wasn't 100% impressed with it, but I think it'll be cute for the summer. I basically got all my bikinis in black or white, and these ones, this top came specifically with just a very plain pair of bottoms that are just like slightly cheeky. And if you have a bigger tummy, you can always turn these around. So you have more coverage in the front and then less in the back. That's also super cute. This one, I believe I got in a 4X. All their bikinis I got in a 4X and then their clothes I got in a 2X. I find that their swimwear runs very, very small. I honestly purchased like 10 bathing suits. So I'm only showing you guys a select few because their one pieces just didn't work for me. I felt like they were very, very short in the torso and I even have a short torso. I think what all of them were trying to accomplish was the super high leg look. But let's be honest, I have a fupa, I have a tummy. I do not need like no coverage in the front. I need a little bit of coverage, you know? So I, I'm not keeping any of the one pieces, but I did find a few of the two pieces to be super awesome. So this next one I bought alone and I'm gonna pair it with the next two tops that I showed you. So it's just these cheeky bikini bottoms with an open tie side. It's just so cute, so trendy, and I'm sure they have this in other colors. I try to keep all my bottoms in black just because I feel like other colors from Shein can be see-through, but the black ones are usually fine. I did get one white top, but I think it'll be okay because there's a few layers in front of my boob, so it's not gonna show anything. But yeah, super cute piece. I got this in a 3XL. I probably could have gotten it in a 4XL, honestly. Okay, so the next two items are basically the same top. So I'll start with the white one. It's just a cropped bathing suit top. It is lined on the inside with those pads that you could remove and there's like a small band. I have some rolls like on the upper part of my tummy that I try to hide normally. Um, I don't like highlighting those. And again, there's nothing wrong with your rolls. Like wear whatever you feel comfortable in. I just feel more comfortable if I don't have them like exposed when I'm wearing a bathing suit. And also I'm trying to cover just a teeny bit more skin because we all know I had biopsies done, so. Yeah, I have one right in my back. So this will cover that biopsy so I don't have to worry about that ever coming into direct contact with the sun. But I like that it's strapless. I wanted just a super easy piece to throw on in both a white and a black. And I think they both look really good together. I probably could have even gone one size down 
just so it really fit the top. I got both of them in a 4XL. And yeah, I think these pieces are super nice. I wish they had some like pink colors in this top. That way I could get a little bit more adventurous. And I feel like it would have been super cute if they made it so there was like a little, like it came to the top in a little tie. I think that would have been really, really cute. But again, it was super cheap and it'll last me this summer. Honestly, what more can I ask for? Perfect to add to the collection of bathing suits that I have. All right, you guys, that is all I picked up. I picked up a lot more, but again, it was a lot of fun pieces that didn't fit and I didn't even want them on camera. I didn't even want to promote them. I was, however, pleasantly surprised with the dresses. Those fit really well and they were good quality. I think I'm gonna have to go back and do another Shein haul later and kind of refine the pieces that I get, like not get any more bathing suits, but really look at the clothing and the tops in general. I did get one pair of jeans shorts in a size 20, but they had no stretch and I couldn't even pull them up. So I didn't even bother showing those to you guys either. So yeah, they're kind of hit or miss, just like Boohoo or any of these places. I kind of like Boohoo more, honestly, just because I feel like I get more wins than I get losses. And it was Shein, I definitely got more losses than I got wins. But again, for the price and the great return policy, you can't really beat it. So if you are able to spend like $200 to get all of these clothes and then kind of sift through them once you get them home, then I think it might be worth it. But if you can't do that, I feel like Boohoo or just a different site with more quality pieces would be a better option overall. But yeah, this was a super quick video. I'm actually really shocked. Definitely will get more in the future for you all. But thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. That way we have our engagement for YouTube standards. If there's anything that you guys have personally got from Shein that you've loved, please link it below. I would love to see it so I can kind of try some more things out for myself. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you want to stick around on the channel, you can hit that little notification bell. That way you will get notified every time I upload a new video. So then you can catch the next Shein haul. All right, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.